Hey, what's up? Jigs are here. Are you having trouble launching Fortnite because of an error message saying Easy Anti-Cheat is not installed? Easy Anti-Cheat is an important part of Fortnite, keeping the game safe and ensuring a fair playing field for everyone. In this video, I will show you how to fix this issue and get you back into playing Fortnite games. Let's go. When you encounter this error in Fortnite, it might be because you declined to install Easy Anti-Cheat during the initial setup. Since Anti-Cheat is essential, Fortnite won't launch without it, so follow the next steps to easily fix this issue. Just open the Epic Games Launcher and navigate to Fortnite. You should then be prompted to install Easy Anti-Cheat. Simply follow the on-screen instructions to complete the process and get back to playing. If you don't see a prompt to install Easy Anti-Cheat automatically, you can try this manual method instead. First, completely close the Epic Games Launcher. Next, open File Explorer and navigate to your Fortnite directory. In the address bar, type C colon backslash program files backslash Epic Games backslash Fortnite backslash Fortnite game backslash binaries backslash win64 backslash easy anti-cheat. Right click the easy anti-cheat underscore EOS underscore setup file. Choose show more options and click on create shortcut. Now right click the new shortcut and select properties. Find the target box. Click on space and add install prod-fn after the existing text. Click the Apply and OK buttons respectively to save and close the Properties window. Finally, double-click the shortcut you created. There won't be a visible window, but this runs the easy anti-cheat installation in the background. Once the background installation is complete, simply reopen the Epic Games Launcher and launch Fortnite as usual to get back into your favorite game. That's it! If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions about the video or other problems with your Apple device, leave a comment below. See you next time. Bye.